Well, how's everybody doing? It's a different setup here. Um, I know. Um, sometimes I'll be in here now. Um, for the for the month or two, um, leading up to Calvin Day. Um, now I'm not going to say any more for the moment. Um, we wait for official confirmation, but basically, um, this is basically the command center, I suppose, for what I'm trying to do for Calvin Day and different things like that. This is basically, you know, had to use a different room to get things sorted. That the pitch is crooked. That's a great start. Um, that's up there. But yeah, I want to talk about Andy Kenny. He'd be like, yes, Andy Kenny. Um, he was the former Taoiseach. Um, who wanted to bring an Irish water and the rest of that. Um, well, he's got a nice job in a PO form. Same thing as Norma Foley. Um, you had uh, got for basically covering up the leaving sub was up last year. Um, tried to do it. Spent 10,000 euro of the taxpayers' money trying to do it. To try and stop it from getting out. Um, to basically... Whitewash over it, let's put it that way. Um, so people wouldn't find out about it that you know so many leaving some results were faulty last year. Um and one of the white results and she tried to you know, basically try and smooch it over, I suppose, and pretend but that backfired terribly and I'd spent ten thousand euro anyway on it. Um but yeah, he's part of the PR form. Now this PR form in particular is over hospitals and things like that. Um and basically you might be saying what's a PR form, but basically it's just government fund the again he's getting a big wage out of you get a big pension of it too. Um, one of these kind of like committee yokes, you know, it's kind of one of them. Um, and he having, he's going to have a great time there. He's going to make a hell of us. Um, as all the politicians do when they retire, they just, you know, he should be retired. He has enough money to live on. He's a big job in York too, I think. Um, so, you know, he's fucking, he wouldn't, he wouldn't need the money. There'd be better people that need the money. Um, there's many women and men in Ireland that could do far better jobs than any of the boys in, jo in jobs at the moment. Um, in the doll or in Shannon, or in, uh, even in the hours, to be honest, if we put somebody that hasn't a brain in their head in the hours, um, they probably do far better than Michael Higgins. I don't know what he's doing, Michael Higgins. Um, and the same as the same goes for Norma Foley. If you put even a pigeon in charge, it would be better off than Norma Foley because it's just nonsensical bullshit. <laughs> and then she disappears for about six months and you never find her. Um, like she's disappeared for the last about two months and she's never been found. Um, she's missing. She's missing in action, um, and nobody's bothered to look for, um, because she's up in the mountains hiding in Kerry, um, but yeah, <laughs> I always have to beat him number four, um, but yeah, you know, basically just what more do you want? The PO form, basically just cronyism. You know, his friends and Fina Gale, probably Leo and the Simon and the rest, and probably made sure he had a nice cushy number a nice cushy number we won't have to do much um, but again he could retire he could have retired in the morning and never had the day to day's work but no the more money they want more money um, again it's just full full cycle um, the same when Leo probably gets kicked out of his T-shirt he won't get kicked out um, now after all he's done he should be kicked out but you know he'll still be here he'll still be there um, but yeah let me know what you're taking subscribe for more and bye